Welcome to my channel. Today, I'm going to show you how to make a scattershot or catapult. The catapult is very easy to make. Um, we need to just hold it here, push it down and leave it so it releases the thing that you keep in here. In this case, I use a ball. So here's the ball, you see. So I'm going to bend this, keep the ball here and leave it so it shoots. The things that we'll need to make the catapult is one matchbox, either full or empty, one popsicle stick, and a few rubber bands. The first step is take the matchbox and the rubber band and just pull it over like that and put it on the edge. And take another rubber band and put it and make sure it's secure so it doesn't fall off. The next step is Take the popsicle stick and off 5.3 centimeters. So, okay, now take the smaller part and insert it like this over the and into this part like this and push it all the way and make sure the rubber bands are to the edge okay so next we'll be taking this popsicle stick and put it right here so when we catapult it it's gonna go like and it's gonna come like this so we need to secure it with rubber bands and i'll show you how to do that okay. actually doing that is very easy so we'll just place the popsicle stick like this put it in there and make sure you hold the popsicle stick and just pull it under the matchstick so it goes diagonal. And you will, um, the popsicle stick will go like this, so just make sure you hold it tight. Um, take another rubber band and on the other side, do the same thing. Just pull it over like this. And then now it's both balanced so it won't bend. And you can just um, move the popsicle stick to where you want and I recommend putting it here like in my older model see so just make sure the popsicle stick is in the middle and to the bottom and now the, the catapult is almost ready but when you do this it doesn't give you so much momentum and this popsicle stick will start going up and it's gonna get loose and you have to tighten it every time so instead of this um, we can take more rubber bands and secure it more tightly and just by doing the same process over and over so it just stays there so let's see see now it's becoming more tight and make sure all the rubber bands are here so it doesn't look like a mess so once you do that it doesn't uh, get loosened and just put one rubber band here and pull it over here and another one here and pull it over here so just that it doesn't like bend here and there and um, so it's ready and the next part is putting the hole for the catapult in my older one I actually made two models see right in here and in this hole we can put a ball and then just catapult it but in this one you can just hold the ball like this and make sure it goes there. Or you can use a bottle cap or another container like a small one to put it here. And um, I took the measurement of my ball and um, I made a hole with tape. Basically you can do whatever you want. Here's your catapult already. And if you don't want to put a container you can just put it by hand and leave it and then it catapults. So thank you, please subscribe and like and share. Thank you.